Hello friends, followers and channel members, welcome to another quick but hopefully informative video here in Microsoft Flight Simulator. The great thing about desktop simulators are the fact that you can take them as seriously and make it as realistic as possible or of course you could just simply jump in, fly and have fun. Now, when I set up this YouTube channel just over a couple of years ago, the idea behind it was just to upload a few tutorial videos for those of you who may have been new to Flight Simulator when Microsoft Flight Simulator was released. The premise of the channel was always to try and make flying in the simulator as realistic as possible. And that meant doing everything that you would do as a real world pilot here in the simulator. If you've watched any of the live streams that we do on the channel, you'll know that we literally take this as far in depth as we possibly can. This involves looking through the operational flight plans, working out how much fuel we're going to need based on real weather conditions, making sure the aircraft is fully set up complete with all of the accurate flows that the pilots need to do and then giving you all a thorough pre-flight briefing just like pilots would do to each other before stepping into a real aircraft. Now of course really delving deep into all of the systems and recreating the flights here in the desktop simulator as realistically as you can in real life isn't everybody's cup of tea but that's essentially how the channel was built and I'm really thankful that we've got an amazing community of you all out there that love watching the live streams and come on board and ask questions and ask to learn how to fly the aircraft as real world pilots do. With the release of the Phoenix A320 however this also means that we really can take our desktop flight simulation to the next level within Microsoft Flight Simulator. With pretty much every part of the aircraft working and functioning correctly, this means that those of you who do want to take your simulation to the next level and fly as realistically as possible are now able to do that. Of course, learning to fly a machine as complicated as the Airbus A320 isn't going to happen overnight. But like all things, the more you practice, the better you get at it. So how do we learn how to fly this aircraft as they do in real life? Well, of course, there are videos and tutorials on YouTube, some of which are created by real world pilots. And of course, there are the live streams that we do here on this channel, which again, tries to mimic how things are done in the real world. But trying to follow along from videos and live streams isn't always easy. What would be much easier is if you had an SOP, that is an airline standard operating procedure guide. Now, of course, unless you work for an airline, you're not going to find these readily available on the internet. However, I am thrilled to announce that a very, very in-depth standard operating procedure for the Airbus A320 guide has been made available to you all for download on our Discord server. Now, this guide has been written by HD. For those of you familiar with the channel, he is a type-rated A320 pilot flying for a major European airline. And this standard operating procedure booklet is certainly not just a little bit of light reading. In fact, it is pretty much as close as you are going to get to the real world Airbus standard operating procedure guide that you will find without actually working for an airline. And one of the truly amazing things about this document is it's available for free. It literally will take you step by step from the cold and dark aircraft that you arrive at to the full setup, all of the planning that needs to go into this, how you can operate everything on the aircraft correctly and take you right down to the other end at your destination after you've landed. This document is 168 pages long, taking you through all aspects of successfully piloting the Airbus A320 as you would do in the real world. The document discusses far too many things for me to possibly list and talk about here in this video, but it even goes as far as to give information regarding which pilot does what, depending on what role they're taking for that flight with the task sharing tables. Knowing all of the flows, for instance, is also a crucial part to being able to fly this aircraft correctly and they are all included in this document. One of the sections that is really discussed in a lot of detail and I know many of you are going to enjoy reading this is the approach part of the flight. So this document goes into lots of detail regarding ILS landings, RNAV landings, visual circuits, circle to lands, that kind of thing, including bulk landings and go arounds. And it also discusses limitations with regards to things like automatic landings. At the very end of the document is the Airbus checklist, something which is absolutely essential to be able to fly the aircraft correctly. 
So how realistic is this document compared to the one used by pilots in real life? Well, it's incredibly close to the real world Airbus standard operating procedures, but there is of course a big caveat. None of this information is ever to be used for real life flying. And of course, it has been tailored in some respects because in a desktop simulator, for the most part, you're always flying as a single pilot. That said, it's probably the most information you're ever going to read without actually working for a real airline. So I hope you'll join me in giving a big shout out to HD by leaving a lovely comment down below and thanking him for all of the work that he's put into creating this 168 page document. This is essentially your Bible for flying the Airbus A320 family correctly in your desktop simulators. If you check out the video description, there is a link there to join our Discord server and you'll find this document in the pilot briefing room. Also in the comments down below you'll see that there is a link to HD's own YouTube channel who occasionally when he has a chance takes you on a live stream operating the aircraft as he does in the real world. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you found this video and the information within it useful. Do go ahead and get that document. It is a fantastic read and will open your eyes up to the wonderful world of flying as realistically as possible in your simulator. If you have enjoyed the video, please do leave a like. And of course, if you are new to the channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and turn on the notifications bell so you don't miss any future live streams and video content. Thanks so much. I'll see you all again on the next one. Bye bye for now.